Good afternoon, everyone. The story I'm going to tell you is the gift of the sun. Suvani loved to bask all day in the sun. Every afternoon, when the sun began to set, he stood up and went to milk the cow. One day, as he was milking, Suvani said, I'm tired of all this milk. I'll steal the cow and buy the gold. Early the next morning, Solani left the house with his cow and returned with the gold. <sighs> Solani, sighed Dora, his wife. You have sold the cow, and now we'll have no milk. Solani went back to his life until one day. The goat ate all the store of dried corn. Wake up, wake up, Solani! shouted Dora. That goat has eaten all our seeds! It will have to go! Solani felt sad. He traded the goat for a sheep. Now, it's time to share the sheep. When Solani was sharing, he thought, Let's work. It's too much for me. I will sell this and the sheep. After selling the sheep and this, Solani brought three kids home. But when Dora saw them, she said, Solani, we need seeds. Not kids. It's spring and time to plant our crops. The next morning, poor Thrani exchanged the gifts for some seeds and started planting. Soon, the first green shoots broke through the soil. The one we did the field imagined the wonderful house they would have. However, one day, Dora ran and cried, Solani, come and look! You have planted a field of sunflowers! What good are they to us? All they do is follow the sun from morning to night. Just like you. Solani felt sad. All he wanted was to please Dora. As the weeks passed, the sunflower tests were flapping and dropping their seeds underground. There were so many seeds that Solani fed them to the hens. Not long after, Dora went to collect eggs and came back excitedly. Solani! said Dora. This test, I laid more eggs than ever before. They must take the sun for seeds. Now, we have extra eggs to sell. At last, Solani had done something right. He saw the eggs and bought a ship. Later in the season, the ship had twin lamps. Solani kept the lamps, stole the ship, and proudly brought home the cow. Dora was delighted to have milk again. Soon, Solani became so busy training the animals that he no longer had time to sit the bow in the sun. But he always spent some time to milk the cow. You know, Dora, my best thoughts come to me while I'm milking, said Sulani. When the sun went down over the hill, they both burst out laughing. Ha ha ha! Thanks for listening.